stuff on my chest. And every time I'm here, you know, I talk about something that really bothers me. And tonight, what I want to delve into, it's a rough topic, and I'm afraid I might make some enemies, but... Okay, thank you. I'm really upset about rap music. Really? No, this guy. Ooh. So hear me out, hear me out, okay? So I love rap music. I love it. I listen to it all the time until I start listening to the lyrics, okay? And really paying attention to the lyrics and, and reading them. And I was like, I was like a little offended by, uh, by what I read. And I brought a couple tonight to read to you so that you knew what I was talking about and you could see where I'm coming from, okay? You guys ready? About, I have three. I have this classic one from 50 Cent. I know that he's not as popular anymore, but I, I think this is a good song for the most part. Uh, so here it goes. You can find me in the club, bottle full of bub. Look, mommy, I got the X if you're into doing drugs. Okay, you guys know that one? Woo! Okay. Oh, oh, it might not be as good as when I'm doing it, but. Um, Alright, this is another one by Usher. In this club, in this club, ladies, can I put this love up in you? Okay? It's <laughs> good, it's classic. Now, this other one, Lil Wayne. Okay, I know Lil Wayne is so popular right now, and I don't want to take the little wind out of your little sails. But uh, Lil Wayne has something to answer for here with this one, I think, okay? Uh, she wants to take it all off up in this club, and I told her, don't stop, get it, get it. Great. So, uh, slip this back in here. Uh, are, you, are you guys noticing a trend here? You noticing something? It's disgusting, right? Every fucking rap song is about going out. It's about going out to the club. Every fucking song, that's all I've got to say. I gotta go out to the club, the club, the club. Look, for somebody who primarily enjoys staying inside, it's like really hurtful. It's like really isolating, you know? To hear that over and over, going out, going out, going out. It's like, oh, oh my god, my my people, people who like to be indoors, indorians, as we like to be called, we're an oppressed minority, okay? We're sick of hearing this. Like, for once, for once, I would like to hear some really good hip-hop music about, like, staying in, experimenting with some recipes, <laughs> hanging out with my cat. <laughs> Rewatching the first three seasons of Mad Men on DVD. <laughs> Eagerly anticipating the fourth season DVD release in March. <gasps> oh. uh. Reorganizing your book collection so that it's now nonfiction, memoir, fiction, and then broken down into more specific categories. Am I right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. What is that fucking song going to be written? It's 2011, people. And Indorians are oppressed. <laughs> so I decided that I wanted to be the change that I wanted to see in the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Thank you. This guy's got my back. I love it. Uh, and so I wrote my own rap song. Right? And uh, it's about staying in. It's called In the Indoors. <laughs> Do you guys want to hear it? Yeah. 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 All right, all right. Uh, it's all it's written. I don't have the beats laid out yet, though. But it's real simple. It's real old school. It's just got the like boom, boom, shh, boom, boom. Shh. Okay, you guys ready? My name is Lucy, and I'm here to say you can stay inside and still enjoy the day. You don't need hiking boots or a fixed gear bike to sit on the couch doing the things I like. Mad men, big love, Simpsons.